And welcome to the Part-Time Nerd Podcast with me, your host, Alan. And joining me today is one Mr. Rapid Dave. How are you doing today, buddy? I'm pretty good, man. How are you? Yeah, I'm doing pretty good. So here we are. We we, we had a week off from Star Trek. Uh, we just had a lot going on. Didn't get a chance to sit down and record, but we're back. Season 1, Episode 3, where no man has gone before. Let's get into it. What are some of your thoughts on this one? Gary is effing nuts, or whatever that <laughs> thing is. Uh <laughs> it's actually i watched it again today okay and i'm, I'm getting into these freaking shows where i'm i can't look away i don't know how the hell am i being dry like just sucked into these shows yeah it's i, I i'm 100 <laughs> on board with you um it, it's i get done watching it and i'm like man I, I need to watch the next one i need to watch the next one and the next one like it played and been... i go all right but <laughs> i left it alone <laughs> i was like no nah, no nah, nah, i'm not gonna skip yeah. ahead um yeah it, it's crazy now there's a there's fist fights there's uh it's pretty much anything you could want but anyhow this uh what do you want to call it an entity this uh you know alien whatever takes a gets in to this one guy gary you know we, we never seen gary before but we see gary now and then yeah by gary <laughs> yeah and it's it, you're dealing with esp um yeah. and it's just I, it, it was just crazy right like no janice this time no janice um you know, and when i looked at the cast it brought up the the woman who was in there for five seconds mm -hmm. and i was like she didn't do anything other than like oh this is i'm blah 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 and he goes yeah all right sit over there or whatever <laughs> the other woman that they brought in she looked very familiar. And I'm telling you, I was like, I know her from somewhere because her face, you know, the way her face looked, her mouth was kind of shaped and how she talked. That's the professor from back to school. With what? Randy <laughs> Swear to God. I even looked it up. I go, I know it's her. It has oh, her. Man. Sally Kellerman. And uh, yeah, dude, I was like, I 100%. I was like, I know it's her. I, it was somebody. So anyways, I looked it up and sure as hell, that's who it was. Dude, that's awesome. Yeah. Yeah. Jeez. But you've got Captain Kirk's one of his best buddies, Gary. That you know they they went through the academy together, and you know Kurt requested him to be on ship with him and all that. So this is this is his ride or die. Mm -hmm. uh, and then let's just go ahead. To, we we go over to the die side of things. Um. <laughs> <laughs> he gets his you know the thing, and, then, and it's like their eyes look like a TV that's been left on at late at night back in the day. You know it was. Right. Like, and uh he's telepathic he's he's a little bit of sith lord as well he can shoot bolts of fire. Yeah, yeah he can he can zap your ass if you come at him he can get out of any situation he's you know a, a self-proclaimed god by the end of the show yes. yeah and he, he's absorbing every bit of information he can get his hands on and and just just so you know on this one we got a lot of rips in this episode because <laughs> the ship gets sh you know shot shocked and when that happens nine people die yeah. like they're doing a status report and he's like we got nine deaths captain like dang so you keep track of this right oh yes oh okay, i'm okay. definitely keeping track don't you worry sir all right um, sure. but you you have that going on and then you have throughout the course of it you have another blue shirt and two brown shirts mm -hmm. uh so we have a death total of 12 total on this episode oh, um cool. i did miss hold on one second um, so I can give you the grand total. I forgot to write it down on this page. Okay. Um, so our grand total is three blue shirts, one mustard, two brown, and one random. The guy wasn't in like a shirt. He was just wearing a random outfit. Right. That was the karate gi guy, right? No, because that guy came back. This was oh, in the okay. first episode. Yeah, this was in episode number one. Okay. You had a guy coming out in like some sort of like a space suit or something like yeah. that. Yeah. Um, it, uh, it looked like one of those uh, radioactive. He was going back in time. Right. Um, <laughs> and then you have just nine unknown. We don't know what color their shirts were, but nine unknown. So that's going to bring our death total to a total of 12, 14, uh, 16 total have They're died in three episodes. Pretty quick. Losing it's, people pretty quick. It's it's going pretty fast. Did you mention um, the name of this uh, this episode? Where No Man Has Gone Before. There you go. Yes. Yeah um but yeah it's just kurt's trying to talk some sense into his buddy because he can see he's still in there mm -hmm. uh but he, he just can't overcome 
what's going on. You have an awesome fight scene. Like the, the fight scene between Gary and Kurt is just yeah, it's they, classic, they, right? I guess when he gets jolted or whatever, the 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 being inside is a, gets you know put to the side, and then all of a sudden Gary's there. And so for a moment, and they start just dude, he lays into him. I'm like, what the hell? Like, couldn't you just shoot him or something? Why what's up with all the physicality? Why are you? I mean, he's got the double knuckled over the top, you know, like that, and then he sucker punching him in the gut. I think there's a lot of throws too. Times. Oh, there's judo there's throws are real in this show. All over the place. Like mm -hmm. sweep the leg, Johnny. It's going down. Uh but I mean, all in all, I I <laughs> again. I find myself talking about how much fun I had with this because um, it's just, and I think, I, I don't know if this is something I would have liked when I was younger, uh, but me being at the phase of my life where I am now, I can, I watch this and I can just, the randomness and the quirkiness and the campiness of it, I can just, it just draws me in and sucks me into where I'm just like, yes, let's go. I, I am ready for this over the top stuff yeah. so i don't think i would have liked it either at at that age because i think it you know even being younger it just wasn't i wasn't interested in this mm -hmm. i was star wars all the way and so star wars kept my attention anytime they were talking about like any type of space or whatever if i wasn't watching cartoons i was watching star wars so i mean obviously star trek was available it just wasn't something they put on in our house so yeah and i could see like younger me being a big star wars fan watching this episode and seeing gary with his force lightning just be like oh come on you're just gonna rip off a of star wars now um <laughs> even, though, even though this came out before it you know I mean? exactly but younger me wouldn't have i, I wouldn't have time for that time that type of rationale right it's <laughs> you, you stole from star wars gosh you're, you're just such a spare so yeah. I'll be honest. I was looking, um, I was I'm watching this on Amazon. And so mm -hmm. it shows like season three or whatever. Almost every single cover is Shatner with some lady. You know what I mean? Like it, it's like everyone he's just, I'm like, are we going to make it to season three? Or, I mean, how many of these things do we have to watch? But dude, it's like definitely, isn't that what Francis's mom said? Like there was a lot of that going on. Oh yeah. How they acted and talked on this spaceship was crazy. Cause Gary was even like hitting on, one of them at one point, like, hey, I eat. and then before he turned into the doctor, Doctor Daner. Yeah, there you go. My God, <laughs> I mean, it was just, it's fun. I'm enjoying it, and and like you're saying, you know, are we going to get through all these? Or what do we need to watch? I'm having fun with this. So I'm in on watching. Like, let's say, hey, I let's just go to the next episode. Let's mm -hmm. just go to the next episode because I'm I'm having fun with it. Um. Maybe I might start watching a couple episodes a week as opposed to just one a week. Um, but I, again, I, I'm I'm having fun, and if you're having fun with something, why not? Right, right. So yeah, that, I mean, it's keeping my attention. That's for sure. For sure, mm -hmm. it's it's must watch, and I can't look away when I'm watching it. It's I'm <laughs> locked in. Even Don't that terrible episode it. with uh, last week, with even Charlie? that one kept us stuck. I was like, God, yeah, yeah. That episode with Charlie in there was just. Charlie was, was terrible. Absurd. God, I'm surprised they didn't get it canceled. Like right after that, I'm like, you know what? We've seen enough. And you, Charlie, you're never working as an actor again. <laughs> you're never working in Hollywood again. Then he looks at him and hits him with his stuff. <laughs> oh my God. Oh, you got anything so else stupid. on this episode? Nah, get it, get your ass in there and watch it. Yeah, go watch it. Check it out, guys. Thanks so much for watching. Like, share, subscribe, follow, comment. If you have anything you want us to watch, go ahead and shoot us over an email, part-time nerdpodcast at gmail.com. Until next time, we'll talk to you guys later. Deuces.